Now they say all this has happened before and will happen again. Will there be any more Battlestar Galactica deadlock? I don't know. I'm coming in now to do the final mission of the Battlestar Galactica deadlock armistice campaign, which could well be the final mission ever. It's called Operation Raptor Talon and is the final instalment of the three-year deadlock campaign we've all learned to grow and love. Let's go in and get the briefings. Oh, sir, uh, are you sure you're okay to be up here just yet? A bullet in the shoulder doesn't stop me from walking, son. Have we heard back from Fleet Command? Operation Raptor Talon is on the board. They're just waiting for 75 to pit stop at PyCon so you can check into HQ. Not happening. I'm staying on Galactica until we see the end of this. Do we have an LZ for Raptor Talon? Intel is just getting a final fix on the site. There wasn't much of that base star left to pull coordinates from. Gives us some time to say goodbye to the Praetor, at least. What? I thought we agreed you were staying here. Got the assignment an hour ago. I'm meeting Sarkis at Simtar. Some black file out in the back end of nowhere. You know the deal. I needed you there yesterday. Just you and him. I know, Silas. I know a pasture when I see one. So why go? Why not stay here? Or hide? Space is a big place. Because I believe him. We are going to end this war. I don't know how. But if there's a price to be paid, so be it. Have you at least talked to your boy? I'll visit Zack on my way through. His father already knows I'm coming. Could never get anything past Carlos. Take care, Sam. I'll see you on the other side. I promise. Tactical details are in from Admiralty, sir. Just waiting on jump sync confirmation. We're meeting BSG-83 Columbia at the LZ. Objective is to find and destroy any evidence of weapons manufacture that Clothos was running. We're responsible for clearing any Cylon resistance we find so that 83's infill teams can break Atma. I'll be honest, Commander. Pretty excited to see Columbia in action. Heard they've seen almost as much of the war as we have. Can't imagine we'll have much trouble with two sets of Chromebusters on site. Feels like we're about to end this thing once and for all. So like I say, it all starts to come down to this and to this indeed. Mission 8, Operation Raptor Talon, deep in silent territory. We've got the Battlestar Columbia over to the top left hand side of the screen. And we're going in there with three Battlestars, an Adamant and a Janus class missile boat. Currently, there are five other Cylons on the screen, which we're going to engage. Will this be enough? I'm expecting big things. So this is going to play out what we saw in regards to Blood and Chrome's opening sequence. Prepare to jump in three, two, one. Okay, here we go. We're loading. Straightest contacts. Hostiles are on the board, and so is Columbia. Clear the LZ, Commander. We need a clear sky before Columbia can start sending recon down to the surface. Launching alert, Vipers. So there you go, Columbia's there. Now, for those of you who have seen the mini-series and the web shorts that um, dictate around on, the Commander. happenings of Operation Raptor Talon, you see that? Old Adama gets shot down to a planet and he finds a base star. Now we know this to be the Guardian base star. Yes, sir. That is included in the modern ship pack of Battlestar Galactica Deadlock Armistice. Right, we know this. So we know what happens to Columbia. Best thing we can do, launch all the fighters, because we know it's doomed, fire as many missiles as we possibly can at those base stars and try and hold them off as long as possible until we can close the gap. Now I'm going to fire a volley of missiles directly at that base star as well. I've got I've got a That's nuke uh, packed up Priority on that Janus class taken. missile boat, and our missiles are away. Columbia is firing. We're turning to the side, but the elevation of Columbia so is quite low on. down, so it's just going to hit the top armor, 
and you know the top armor is very weak very weak on a jupiter class one if it is indeed a jupiter class one in which case you know the jupiter two on the top has got a hundred confirmed squadron target you know on the jupiter one on the top it's like 60 i think it is yes commander or 90 it's 90 points of armor on the top so we're going to get our raptors in we're still going to fire some rockets Columbia's birds are indeed in They're putting the up air. a hell of a fight out here, sir. Cylon Command really End wants to turn. make sure we don't now go the down there and find their weapon. Are also what do you think it is? Chemical missiles? On our back New as well. They're star. launching their That's fighters. The base stars have launched their fighters. There's my slew for a nasty of missiles going in now against wrong. that one particular base star. The base star on the left, however, is pummeling Columbia with torpedoes. There's no way of saving this. Its armor is virtually down. Engineering is down. It's got no fire control. Yes, you know, it's in a right mess. All we can do is, well, there's no point Missiles praying. Incoming. We know what's going to happen. Damage. It doesn't make it any, any less Hostile desperate. You know, we're trying to save it. We're trying to change history. Flaps going on. It's not making the blindest bit of difference because it's hitting the top armor of Columbia. It's not going to last another round. Even with full defense and whatnot. Our missiles are going to go in and make a right mess of that base there. With our Raptor, it that shot its missiles. Let's get it to get in there and board that base there. Friendly unit down. Columbia's down. Gods. Put everything we have out there, Commander. No one sits on the sideline today. And with that, that's the end of Columbia. Columbia is down. Though that other base star, we've hit it with a right volley of missiles from our fleet. Well, that's going to be down really quickly too. Now the other Cylons have managed to close. There's a Revenant there. We're going to use guns. We're going to tear them apart with our cannons. Fire those munitions. Come on, come on, come End on. turn. Target is four, five by nine, nine. More missiles coming in from the base there. Missiles now our squadrons are way out, way out of the way, so we can hit them more with some flak. Might be able to deflect some yes, with the flak on the left-hand side. Come on, Galactica, use that flak shield. Everything else is fine. We get some flak firing off from that Jupiter Mark One, the Hecker. That might deter some of those fighter squadrons as well. Sir, one of our Vipers is breaking for the surface. Concentrating on those base stars, and on the left, right hand side. Husker. Yes, sir. Don't tag him MIA yet. He's too bullish to die down there. We'll pick him up once we've finished here. So, base star down. We have taken a few hits. The flak screen has sort of like sorted it out. We've got a raptor squadron on the other base star as well. So, um, we're giving that a good hammering. There's a revenant. Now, we all know throughout the entire three years of me playing Battlestar Galactica Deadlock, I hate them. Okay. So, we're going to see if we can hit them with another volley of uh, missiles. Man, I am having mouse problems. We're going to turn them away from the other two ships. Intercepting. Directly at the one that's closest to us. Guns are on focus. I'm getting strong reads from the and surface. away we go. It might be from a base star from what I'm seeing. Whatever that's it is, I think it's about to come too. online. Have we got radio with Husker? No, sir. We lost contact soon after he broke sky. Commander, clear the hostiles and prepare for more incoming. Even now, all we get is more fighting. So that's it. <clears throat> Still plowing on ahead, fighting the war. Centurions have boarded one of our ships. The Adam base star, the Canadian damage. base star on the planet is warming up, ready to jump. Lady 
missiles away. We're still steaming towards that base that he's really going to get it if we get close enough. Cancel some flak. We are going to take some hits. Nothing we can't handle, though. Got it. Fire some missiles, paint the target with our assault raptor. End turn. Friendly squadron is dark. Friendly squadron is dark. So Revenant down. New Dreyus contacts. Now Cylon reinforcements on, on the board. There. More Cylons have jumped in, but judging how close they are together, I think that's a nemesis. Firing more rockets. More missiles. A battle star not quite is being looking hacked. so bleak at the moment. We are taking some damage, though. Sir, all hostiles just jumped Someone's away. Trying to hack us. What about the surface base star? More Frank? missiles and rockets Let's away. They jumped. The Cylons have jumped away. They've done a runner. Leaving us at one o'clock half struck. So time to tidy up with our fighter squadrons. Well, that actually looks like it. They've legged it. They've disappeared. Are you... You're getting this too, right, sir? The broadcast authentications check out. It can't be real, can it? It's real, son. Put it through to speaker. Everyone should hear this. I repeat, all Ministry of Defense units are ordered to stand down. An armistice with the Cylons has been signed. A full ceasefire is in effect as of now. Hour 7 of Day 4571, Capricorn Standard. All Ministry of Defense units, stand down. Holy frack! We did it? We did it! The war is over! <laughs> That's what it sounds like. But what about Raptor Town? We didn't find any superweapon, let alone destroy it. I believe we just watched it jump away. Stand the fleet down to condition two, Mr. Singh. And get in contact with Husker. Make sure he knows we're done out here. We're going home. And that's it. Battlestar Galactica deadlock over. Let's get into that replay straight away. We're going to get some fantastic shots as well, I think, uh, from the battle cam. There's our missiles away. Loads of missiles being fired out. We've got our squadrons in the air. There goes the nuke. It's not going to be enough to save poor Columbia, but we're going to give it a good go. Raptors are firing. The vipers are like small insects up against it. There's Columbia getting a bit of a pasting. Time to pause that action and get ourselves in there to photo mode and get at least get a good picture of the last moment of Columbia. There you go. There it is. Right there. See all the missiles hitting the top armor. Flak screen. No good at all whatsoever. Wow, well, looks like a screenshot to be saved for me. The last moments of Columbia. There it is. Cylon Raiders. So with Columbia gone now, we've still got their squadrons in the air. We've got their Raptors. We've lost their missile bank. Uh, we've still fired quite consistently on that other uh, base star. That base star is going to go. And we can turn our attention to the other. 
There's four missiles going in for the Revenant. He's gone. Reloading. God damn it, they got me. Base star down. Intercepting. I need flak reload. Then effectively down. it turns into what could be said as a Viper mission. Wrangling our fleet around, swinging in for the remaining base star. Not today, Cracker. More Not missiles today. away. Cylons trying to hack us. Get a good shot for Taipan. I've got four feet, upper seven. Right. Missile hits there to Galactica. That secondary battery. Full attack mode. Fire at will. Cylon Revenant down. I'm hit! I'm hit! I'm hit! Here's the reinforcements. The they jumped Take it down. in. Take it down. Got them now. Here's our no missile strike going, going into that like base star. Not today. All right, let's bring our people home. And that is effectively it. That is the end. Three years, it came down to that. That one final scene. The extinction of the Columbia, but let's proceed. There are those who believe that life here began out there. That there may yet be brothers of man who even now fight to survive somewhere beyond the heavens. We survived our tools, barely. We made mistakes up until the very end. But they were beautiful mistakes, born from hope and faith and passion. In the end, it's not how the fight finishes. But that we fight at all. For emotion, for software, it doesn't matter. It is all the same thing eventually. Love outlasts death. We created the Cylons because we thought we could make life better. But all we had made was just another gun and no idea who the target was supposed to be. With that flaw built in from the beginning, do we blame the hammer for striking the carpenter? The gods laugh at us every day for thinking we know better. Hubris, not the Cylons, should have been our downfall. But, but for, for the, the intervention, intervention of God, this has all happened before. And may yet happen again. So we live each day in peace with family, knowing how fragile it all really is. Knowing how easily one day it might all end. So say we all. So say we all. So say we all. So say we all. So there it is, everybody. That was it. The final mission of the Deadlock campaign ever. And that's according to Black Lab Games. Hope you've enjoyed my gaming playthroughs of all the campaigns of Battlestar Galactica Deadlock, along with my collaborations with other YouTubers and Twitch supporters as well, and my breakdowns against the ships. All these are on the channel, and if you're still with me, I really do appreciate your viewership. Please check back for more videos. I'll be going into the ships in detail for Battlestar Galactica Deadlock, and may even well do another complete campaign rerun, because it's compelling gameplay, it's good real-time strategy, and it's Battlestar Galactica. I've been Ricardo of Ricardo's Gaming Channel. Like and subscribe if you haven't done so. So see we all and launch them Vipers. <laughs>